Yo guys, Money here, and in this video I'm going to be bringing you guys an awesome solo money glitch on GTA 5 Online. Now the gameplay is going to be coming from Roll Easy, so be sure to check him out. His link will be in the description below. Um, so be sure to check out his channel, and also this glitch is very easy, but there are some prerequisites that you guys will need, which will be explained in the video again. Also, uh, be sure to check out the Prestige Giveaway. We're giving away a whole bunch of stuff, as you guys already know. Just uh, make sure you guys enter that link. will also be in the description below. I hope you guys enjoy this video, and I'll see you. Yo, what's happening out there, gamers? It's Roll Easy here, and I'm back with a dope solo money glitch video for you guys. It's pretty freaking easy, I'm not going to lie. There are a few things that you need to worry about, but once you get past that, you're, you're safe. You're good. All right, so... The founders of this glitch are 115 Stig and 707 Dopper. So, shout out to you guys. Their links will be down in the description. Now, what you're going to need for this glitch, you do need a facility. So, this is a solo facility glitch, the first one of its kind. We had a two player glitch before, but now this is the solo one. Along with that, you want to go ahead and have the car you want to dupe in your facility. So, I recommend the Retro LG Custom. If you don't have enough money for that, buy another Benny's vehicle. Benny's vehicles you will sell for the most. If you want to dupe a supercar or a sports car, make sure you just dupe it once, sell the original, and then you keep the dupe for yourself because the dupe doesn't sell for shit. All right? So that's what you want. Fill up the rest of your facility with RH8s. All right? That's the easiest way to do it. So just put a bunch of RH8s or Fagios inside the facility. The one car you want to dupe in there, you also need an MOC. All right, so in your MOC, you want the personal vehicle storage, and you want to have an LG RH8 in there as well, okay? And you do not need custom plates for this, guys. No custom plates whatsoever. That's what makes it amazing. So if you have, like, dirty dupes that you want to clean up, you know, just go ahead and dupe over them or whatever, and then you can delete the other, the old one. So, you know, or you can just, yeah, dupe over that one, basically. Just have it in, you know. All right, so this is the way it works. All right, so 06YTN911, all right? Remember that plate. So what the plate that merges onto your new dupe is the last car you drive. So this is what I recommend. Set your spawn location to a facility or to your facility and you need a new session for every dupe. Okay, so when you spawn into your new session, go ahead and drive the elegy that you want to be duped over outside and back in. I like to keep track of what plates are going where. So that's why I was doing this before each dupe. So as you can see right here, all I did is I grabbed an LG RH8, drove it out and drove it back in. Now that's going to be the plate that gets merged onto my brand new dupe, alright, that's very important. I like to really keep track of what plates are going where and what dupes are doing what. That's how I've been safe, you know, for all this time while I've been duping. Alright, so, now that we're good on that, we know that that's the car that we're going to be duping over, that's the plate that's going to be transferring over to the dupe. Now what you want to do is go ahead and grab your LG Retro Custom or your Benny's vehicle, whichever car, you know, you're duping. Well, before you do that, just have that in mind. Have that, you know, have that vehicle in mind. What you want to do now is actually exit the facility. So, once you've exited the facility, this is the part that can be tricky, okay? Now, you just need a little bit of luck for this, okay? It's not hard, it's not tricky, it's just, you just need luck. Alright, so, I'm going to have the volume up right here. If you listen closely, you can actually hear what I'm doing is I went to play quick job and I'm searching for a doomsday heist, all right? This is how we actually glitch out the facility. So when you do, when you press play quick job and you search for the doomsday heist, you're going to get the little loading icon that says searching for a job in the bottom right, okay? It's still there the whole time, but I'm hovering over play quick job again because when you play quick job again, what happens is it cancels out and then it takes it away. You know, it stops searching for the job. So... At this point, what we're doing right now is I'm just waiting here, all right? I, I pressed, you know, for it to search for a doomsday heist. We're waiting to hear a click or like a click donk noise, okay? That's when it's about to load up, you know, the job. As you can see right there, still looking for a job, 2 minutes and 16 seconds. Or it's, you know, it's gathering up players, okay? It's populating the lobby. So if you listen really, really close here, you're actually about to hear it. This is the successful thing you want to hear, and then you press play quick job right away. So check it out. Right there. That's what you want to hear. So that was a click right there, okay? That means it was populating lobby. You can go ahead and hit play quick job. That'll cancel it out so it stops searching. Just go right back into your facility, all right? That is exactly what you want to hear. Once you're back in your facility, check this out. You can go ahead and hop into the retro that you want to dupe, and then you can actually drive it around. So just like this. So if you've done that successfully, boom. The rest of the glitch is super simple, all right? Super, super simple. 
So at this point, what you want to do now is actually break off the driver's side door. So the way you do that is you find, you know, some a pole or something like that or a wall that you can kind of get close to and just spam Y or triangle, you know, to get back in real quick. And uh, once you're back in, just back up to it, you know, and then there you go. You can actually knock the door right off. All right, just make sure he doesn't close the door when he's getting back in. Just spam Y so that he just hops in real quick without grabbing the door. Now what you want to do is go towards your yellow circle and you want to just start edging up, kind of like you see me do in the video, until he can't actually get out through the driver's side door. You want him to get out through the passenger side door. So you want to wedge the driver's side door up against that area. So as you can see right there, I've wedged it successfully. He's getting out through the passenger side. That's going to allow us to, to teleport once we block off the other side. So as you can see right here, this is the car that we're duping over, 06YTN. All right, might as well just use this one to block off the door so that there's no confusion. So what we're doing with this RHA right here is we're actually going to go ahead and we're going to block off the passenger side door. So we're going to block off the passenger side door of the retro and that's going to allow us to spam Y or triangle and that's going to allow us to actually teleport in and out of the vehicle. So as you can see right here, just park it like you see me do right there and then go ahead and walk behind your retro or the car you're duping. First, I just wanted to show you the plate again. This is the plate that's going to be merging onto the uh the retro all right it's the last car we drove out before we got glitched all right so that's why we're using it so go behind your retro spam y a few times spam triangle you'll see you're teleporting once you're good with teleporting spam y and a at the same time to accept the exit facility so that's y and x or sorry that's triangle and x on playstation okay you start spamming them at the same time and eventually you'll be teleporting and then you'll also exit the facility you're gonna exit the facility with your car and the brand new dupe check it out 06 ytn just like that guys i'm telling you it's a mad easy glitch right there we already have our brand new dupe here we just need to go ahead and save it so it did right over that lg retro custom that we drove out earlier and the car and the same lg or er, lg retro the same rh8 that we drove out before we started the glitch and that's the same rh8 i also used to block the retro okay so that car is duped over so go ahead and call up your moc and remember i had an rh8 in there so what this is going to do is you press right D-pad, this is going to go ahead and transfer the RH8 over to the actual uh, you know, facility. Once you've done that, this car is saved. It's a brand new dupe, clean plate, 06YTN911, right there. That is what you want to see. Now, very important though, right when you drive back out, what you want to do is go ahead and press pause, go to online, go to jobs, play jobs, Rockstar created and go to missions and start up a Titan of a job, all right? You need to do this or else when you go ahead and you try to go into your facility, you're gonna get bricked or frozen or caught on the loading screen. So just back out of the job once you, st once you enter the lobby. Once you've entered the lobby, you're good. So you won't get you know frozen or anything like that going back into the facility because you're still kind of glitched out, you know? So facility is full. Like I said, remember, fill it up with RH8s and have your one retro that you're duping. Once you've gotten that fuller, you're gonna go ahead and drive in and you're just gonna accept and you're gonna, you know, transfer over an RH8 back to the MOC. So just like that, now we have an, uh, you know, a new RH8 back at the MOC and we actually have two brand new dupes in here now, all right? So once you've done that, go ahead and hit creator and go to find new session. Throw yourself in an invite only session. I don't know if I said that in the beginning, but yeah, invite only sessions, guys. So now, we're in an invite only session, we spawned over at our facility. This is the RH8 I wanna dupe over now. 66 ATH 745, all right? So that's the one we're gonna be duping over. Like I said before, just drive it out and back in. Once you've done that, we're ready to go. That's the car we're gonna be duping over, all right? Duping over. So go ahead and exit the facility. We're gonna go through the same thing again, guys. This one I got super quick. Sometimes it takes a while, sometimes you get lucky, guys. So just go to play quick job, the, the Doomsday Heist alone, are you sure? All right, this time you're gonna hear the donk and click at the same time. So it can be either a click by itself or a donk and a click. So check this out. So boom, just like that. So right when I heard that, that donk click noise, I went ahead and hit play quick job, that cancels out the search, and you can go ahead and go back into your, you know, your facility. Once you've done that, you can hop into your retro. We're just gonna speed through this. I'm gonna break off the door like I showed you before. Edge up near it till I can't get out of the driver's side door. As you can see right there, I'm still getting out. So just keep edging up near it until it forces you out of the passenger side. There you go. That's how you wanna do that. Now go ahead and run up and grab the RH8 that we were duping over before, you know, with that same plate, same one we drove out. Might as well grab that one. Wedge up the driver's side door and just walk behind your retro and start spamming Y or triangle. Once you know you're spamming good, 
Go ahead and spam Y and A to exit the facility at the same time. PlayStation, you're spamming Y and X at the same, or sorry, triangle and X at the same time. And you're gonna exit the facility. If done correctly, you'll spawn outside with your brand new dupe with the brand new plate, all right? That's the same plate from the RH8 from inside that we were using that we drove out before the glitch once again. Just go ahead and call up your MOC. Once you call up your MOC, you're just gonna go ahead and drive it in there and that's gonna save this dupe, all right? So remember, we got the RH8 inside the MOC, so that's gonna transfer over to the facility now. The RH8 is over at the facility. The brand new retro dupe is now saved right here. Okay, now the game knows that this is a retro. It is fully, fully saved with your brand new plate on it. No custom plates needed whatsoever. Drive out. Right when you drive out, you want to go ahead and press pause, go to online, you know, start up a job, missions, Rockstar created, all that stuff. Tighten up a job. All right, just start up, tighten up a job, back out of the lobby once you're in there. All right, once you've done that, you're unglitched, you can go ahead and drive over to your facility. Once you get there, you should get the garage full alert because you have everything in there. It's just, ret it's just a couple retros now because we got some dupes and the rest are RH8s. So at this point, you just go ahead and you transfer an RH8 over to your MOC. So as you can see right here, got a few dupes already. I'm gonna transfer this RH8 over to my MOC and that's it. Go ahead and go to a new session and you're ready for the new dupe, all right? You're ready to dupe again. So a new dupe every session, no custom plates needed. Fill up your garage with RH8s, one retro in there so that you can dupe and you're good to go guys, just like that. Super easy solo money glitch. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. It's very, very easy. Once again, shout out to 115 Stig and 707 Dopper. Uh, great glitch guys definitely cool one uh, I'm enjoying this one as well like you know I've hit it a few times already this morning you just got to get lucky with that you know that beginning part with the play quick job once you get that down you're straight all right the rest of the glitch is mad easy all right so thanks for stopping by the channel guys my name is roll easy if you're brand new make sure to hit that red subscribe button turn on post notifications drop a fat like down on this video for the freshest and the most informative dope GTA 5 online content peace out everybody happy holidays